Hey, it's Ray Colgan from Austin, Texas. Uh, I'm going to read you some beat poetry tonight. And um, I'm going to start with Gregory Corso, my favorite beat poet. And I'm going to read a poem called Away One Year. Now, bear with me. I am not a professional poetry reader, but uh, I hope you can dig this, man. I think of New York City, lost in stars, forgotten as a blue-haired pet of childhood love. Tonight, the night is full. The stealthy mayor in his fine discipline moves in proportion like a large jewel with furry feet. He taps his long, straight nose through the years of his term, a ghost with worried thoughts of city. Beneath the Washington Square arch, he feigns to forget the new denunciations of the day. This has never been the mayor of my city, occasionally stopping in a barren area with magnificent foundations in his eyes. I have not promised blessing upon having Gotham Gate, in lovelier cities I join my dreams, in whose care I depend, though not once owning love to any city but the city in my heart, New York City. It is fierce now, chariot locked in the sky, like a stag scraping its back against mountains, fierce as a doleful vision, giving piteous gramercy in a dying cat's Egyptian eyes. The lovely mouse is a man of dreams, so my city. Dreamy solace of rivers and bridges brightly onion-skinned in the night. Down many urchin avenues, I see the days of my city bearding its face, its measure of skeleton clanking like a stove, the shell of a death come to navigate a city to the tomb. And uh, here's another one by Gregory Corso, A Moment's Wish. Riding on the New Haven Line, Suburbia gave me a good feeling of winter. I would like to have sat in that child's backyard, the lovely winter of that. It's a short one. Well, just check out Gregory Corso. This is the happy birthday of death. Some really great poems in here. Um, takes me longer than three minutes to read them because they're, uh, they're longer. But you should definitely check them out. And I'm going to read some other stuff, maybe another video. Here's to the happy birthday of death by Gregory Corso.